What is the punishment for leaving Islam? So, accept Islam is all about repeating a specific test statement, and then once you have repeated that statement, you are becoming officially a Muslim and you are believing in Allah as the only true God and the unique God of Islam. And then, now to leave Islam, it becomes extremely complicated because what according to all the testimonies I've seen and according to all what I have seen written here in the book it is very complicated to get out of Islam look something like this Muhammad said if someone leaves Islam do you see the word? I don't want to pronounce the word K-I-L-L -L. kill him finish him volume 4 number 52 uh, book 52 number 260 it is rejected to get out of Islam. It is a place where you enter, you do not come out again. That is the reason why many Muslims today, in the Sharia law, it is clear that if anybody there tries to get out of Islam, we just have to give him three days for repentance. If he does not repent after those three days, we finish with him. We finish with him. So it is very complicated. So my question to you that is a Muslim, you want to reject Islam today. I'd like to ask you, do you really believe that Islam is from God? If you truly believe that Islam is from God right now, does this God, is he all powerful, all, let me put it the word, all loving, all loving? Do you really believe that this God is all loving in such a way that no matter what you do, he will do his best to bring you back to the right path or do you believe he is not all loving according to what i have written i have read sorry allah is not all loving allah does not love the unbelievers and there are multiple references you can check my other videos for that where uh, it's clearly written that allah does not love the unbelievers and so on and so forth and then he will urge muslims to fight in his name he will urge muslims to go and kill all even non-muslims to go and kill anybody who tries to reject islam he will urge muslims to catch him and to kill him and then we have multiple references that i can show you about these things fighting in jihad this is what is the best thing Allah John, Muhammad just wanted a group of army people that he can be going from one place to the next, lying them about in specific heaven that they are going to be getting 72 virgins naked on the bed, waiting for them, and then they'll give them a couch, and then they'll give them a bracelet, and then at the end of the day, they will have access to heaven. And that's what Islam is promising people at that time. You will have a couch, you will have a carpet, you will have a, a, a nice house for yourself, and then you have 72 virgins, you have... 5,000 years before you just to do one time and enter with your wife, with your 72 virgins, just one time before one, that white substance comes out of the man, after he's doing exercise on the bed with his woman, before it comes out, it is 5,000 years. Just, you're just there 5,000 years, in and out, in and out, 5,000 years before you do it, before it comes out. <laughs> and then you go to the next wife. And that next wife has 72 mates giving you access to their bodies again. Five to years. And then you have an endless, long sexual organs. The references are there. I will show you guys in the other videos. But for these videos, I just went off topic just to let you guys... Because it's absurd for me. It's so absurd that Muslims are still believing in Islam because they do not think about these things. Muslims, you are a white man was selling black slave. I don't know how much you see it. Are you a racist person watching this video? Do you Are you really a racist? Now when you talk about people and genders and cultures, even though there are, there are only two genders, man and female, and then cultures, people from Africa, people from Asia, Chinese, Europeans, Canadians. Do you see people in terms of their color? Why did they have to precise color? Why did they have to say that he has slaves? And why is your prophet the best pattern of conduct? The best pattern of conduct, which is selling human beings, buying human beings, selling human beings, ordering to be killed, ordering human beings to be killed as he wishes. If somebody leaves Islam, kill him. That is exactly what he said if somebody wants to leave islam kill him the prophet said if somebody wants if somebody a muslim discard his religion kill him that is as simple as that get away from islam my dear friends i'm tired
get away from Islam.